Dear children, we shall learn about the rhombus. So, rhombus is a geometrical shape. Here, a rhombus is a, a parallelogram in which all the four sides are equal. A rhombus is a parallelogram because parallelogram is also a geometrical shape in which all the four sides are equal. Let us learn the important properties of rhombus. All the sides of a rhombus are equal. Side AB is equal to side BC. Side BC is equal to side DC. Side uh, DC is equal to side AD. So all the sides are equal. This is the important property of a rhombus. And opposite sides are parallel. Opposite side AB is parallel to opposite side DC. And opposite side AD is parallel to opposite side BC. So opposite sides are parallel. The diagonal bisect each other at right angles. You can see that diagonal AC bisects with the diagonal BD at O in such a way they form 90 degree. That means the diagonals bisect each other at right angles. That is angle AOD is equal to 90 degree. Angle COD is equal to 90 degree. Angle AOB is equal to 90 degree. Angle COB is equal to 90 degree. So that is about how the diagonals bisect each other. Next, the two diagonals divide the two diagonals divide the rhombus into four congruent triangles, four right angle triangles. You can see here, right angle triangle AOD is congruent to right angle triangle COD. And right angle triangle AOB is congruent to right triangle triangle BOC. You can see four right angle triangles which are congruent to each other. Which are the four right angle triangle? So right angle triangle AOD, right angle triangle DOC, right angle triangle AOB, right angle triangle BOC all are equal and congruent. So angles are bisected by the diagonal. You can see the four angles A, D, C, B. They are bisected by the diagonals. So when they bisected, bisected angles are equal. You can see the bi diagonal A, C bisects angle A. Like the D, A, C and B, A, C. So diagonal A, C bisects angle DSB into angle DAC and angle BAC. So angle DAC is equal to angle BAC. So on the right hand side, angle DCB is bisected by the same diagonal that is AC that is into two bisected angles. Which are the bisected angles? Angle DCA is equal to angle BCA. Now, the diagonal BD bisects the rhombus at point D. That is, angle ADC is bisected by the diagonal BD into two angles. Which are the angles? Angle ADB and angle CDB. Again, at this end, the angle ABC is bisected by the same diagonal DB. Which are the bisected angles? Angle ABD is equal to angle CBD. So that means angles are bisected by the diagonals. Dear student, you have learnt the, the definition of rhombus and important property of a rhombus. So you have to focus on the important property. All the sides are equal and the diagonals bisect each other at right angles.